Good morning, you guys. It's literally so late right now. I woke up this morning at like 7.45 and Milo and I went for a walk. I got in bed, I was reading and I was just gonna have like a chill Saturday morning and I was gonna like do my meditation and um, journal and do a workout. I fell back asleep. I literally fell back asleep and I had no idea. And I woke up and my phone was ringing and Emma was calling me. And I looked at my clock and it was like 11.30. So, good morning. I literally slept for so long. And it felt so good. Clearly my body like needed it. But yeah, welcome back to another vlog. I am going to make my green juice right now. I'm so excited. Start the day. So... Yeah. My favorite song <laughs> of all time. Where'd she go? <laughs> My sesame seeds are hi. Literally pouring. It looks everywhere. Oh my god, I forgot I got veggie cream cheese. Oh yum. It looks really good. Yeah, that looks really, really good. Wait, I need to show you guys. Mm. I got sesame bagel, not toasted, tofu, veggie cream cheese, lettuce, tomato, wait, yeah, lettuce, tomato, capers, jalapenos, and cucumber. <laughs> Hi guys, I just got to the nail salon. I'm gonna go get my gel taken off. And I'm getting new nails put on tomorrow, like the long nails. So I have to get my gel taken off today. I'm so weird, I have to like do them in separate days. I can't just go get my gel taken off before the appointment because getting the extensions already takes like literally an hour and a half or hour and 45 minutes. I don't know how long it takes, but anyway, it takes such a long time and I feel like I just can't sit there for that long. Like I'm patient, but I'm not like that patient yet. So I'm gonna go get my gel taken off right now. Um, it's the next day, by the way. I went to my mom's house for dinner last night, but I didn't vlog. I went with Emma, my stepsisters, and it was really fun. My mom like cooked a bomb meal. Um, sorry, I'm just like putting on. My lips feel really dry. But yeah, we went to my mom's and then Emma slept over and I ended up driving home because I just feel like it's too much, honestly, to like go places and sleep over when I have Milo. Like I could have brought him, but I just feel like, I don't know, it's like a little bit too much for me. Plus like Milo and Zeus are like so crazy when they're together. Like all they do is like run around. They're so, so, so crazy. And I feel like it's just like a lot. So I left Milo at home. I drove down, had dinner, and drove home. So I could be with him. So yeah. Um, I'm going to go in and get my nails done though. And then I have to go to the grocery store. I really need to buy groceries. I'm like running so low. So we're going to do that today also. 
I'm in the south end right now. It's just so pretty. Like these apartments are so gorgeous. Ugh. It's such a nice day. Guys, <laughs> look at my little bare nails. Uh, uh, they're so cute. Oh, well, um, I was listening to this podcast while I was getting my nails done, which I'm actually going to keep listening to right now. It is called, I'm going to, I'm linking the episode for you guys. It's the skinny confidential, how to achieve financial freedom, invest, save. It's like not showing me the whole um, the whole title. Oh, it's called How to Achieve Financial Freedom, Invest, Save Money, and Understand Finances. I, I know always talk about, like, doing, or, like, talking about, like, finances and stuff like that, because I feel like it's something that we don't get taught in school, and I feel like when I started, like, making money, obviously off of YouTube like that's my job when I started making money in the way way beginning I knew that I didn't want to like make any stupid decisions with my money and my parents were getting divorced at the time I just felt like I was so I just felt really lost like I had no idea what to do I just like never knew what to do with my money and I knew that I wanted to like put it away and save it for the future so I got like professional help but all that I have been learning over the past few years Michael talked about in this podcast and so much of what he's talking about are things that I know of so I don't know how to put any of this stuff into words like I'm still learning I'm only 24 but I definitely think investing your money while you're young like in your 20s is one of the smartest things to do but I just think listening to this episode I'm gonna link it for you if you need any advice and yeah, because I know I've always wanted to talk about it and I just like don't really know what to say or like how to get my words out about it and obviously like everybody has different situation but I just think that doing what works best for you based on your income, um, you can still invest like a certain percentage of your income and yeah so definitely listen to this episode i think i think it's really good i have 30 minutes left of it since i just went to the grocery store obviously i have to do a grocery haul so so I'll show you guys what I got as I unpack. We have some eggs. I always make sure to get organic, free range eggs. These ones are local. At my Whole Foods, they have like on the tag where the price is, they say if they're local, if they're like pasture raised, free range, stuff like that. So I like to get these. They're from New Hampshire. So I get the, those kind of eggs every time. They're like, I could tell how fresh they are. They're so good. And then I got some little tomatoes. <gasps> we'll go for a walk. I'm gonna bring Milo up for a walk after I put my groceries away. Um, two types of hummus. I got the Ithaca lemon and garlic. <gasps> Excuse you. You wanna say hi? You wanna say hi to the vlog? Say hello. He's getting a haircut. See, gay haircut? He's getting a haircut Tuesday. It would be so cute. Right now he's so fluffy. Like he literally is so fluffy. He looks so much bigger than he is because of all of his hair. You haven't gotten a haircut since February. Let me let you grow out. And he's getting ready because he's getting neutered next week. Also, or two weeks from now. You okay? We'll go outside in a second. Got the Ithaca hummus. I got the lemon and garlic and the lemon and beet. The ingredients are really good on this hummus. Chickpeas water. Tahini, lime juice, no, lemon juice, garlic, vinegar, salt, crushed red pepper. So, yeah, I really love that. Then I obviously got my almond milk. I got the vanilla milk. And then I got the normal. I like to have both. I don't know why, but 
I'm really into almond milk right now. I don't really drink oat milk anymore. I've been really into almond. And then I also got this plant-based cheese. This one is a cashew cheese. It's by the brand Treeline. Ingredients, cashew nuts, filtered water, sea salt, lemon juice, peppercorns, and it has like cultures in it. So I like the ingredients on that. I've been like really trying to get away from the dairy-free alternatives just because they have so many gums and like added things to them that disrupt your hormones. And I can tell by like all the dairy-free stuff that I was having before, even though it's like an alternative, it was like messing something up in my system. So I've been like being really conscious of what I've been having. Milo's legit biting the back of my jacket. Yo, chill dog. We're gonna go outside in two seconds. Let me just finish this and then we'll go for a walk. Cilantro for the juice, you guys know. What is this right here? Oh, this is my olive oil. Then I got my coconut water for the juices. My green juice, Harmless Harvest, Big Boy Coconut. And then I got a water. Mountain Valley Spring Water. And got some salmon for dinner. I'll show you guys what obviously I'm gonna cook. We'll cook later so you guys can see what I make with the salmon. Ugh. Okay, bag number two. We have some alfalfa sprouts. I'm obsessed with sprouts. They're so easy to add to like salads and stuff like that. They're really good for you. Got some kale. Green onion, <laughs> bell peppers. A big bag of lemons and limes. Then I also got this huge cucumber. And I got an onion, some ginger. What's this, an avocado. And then, oh. Some chickpea pasta. I love the bonza. I got this one, the rotini. Some arugula. Some spinach. And last but not least, I think the bag. Oh yeah. Last but not least, some Mary's crackers. These are my fave jalapeno. I love to have these with the cheese spread I showed you guys. And also hummus. Like my favorite snack. Okay, so I'm gonna put this stuff away really quick and <laughs> Milo and I are gonna go for a walk. I'm cooking some dinner. I first made this sauce right here to go on top. I can't remember what I used off the top of my head, but I'll put the ingredients on the screen and you can pause it and like take a picture or something. But I put them all into my blender and then it made this sauce right here. Made some quinoa and I'm gonna air fry a piece of salmon. I just put some salt, pepper, and a little bit of paprika on top, and then I drizzled it with olive oil to start, and I'm also gonna put probably like fresh lemon on it once I'm done. So I preheated my air fryer to 390, and I'm gonna put it in for seven minutes. I'm just cutting up some tomato. I'm adding everything to this big bowl right here because I really like to mix everything together with the dressing before I have the salad instead of just like putting the dressing on top. I just feel like it tastes so much better when everything's like already mixed in. I'm keeping it really simple tonight. Just tomatoes, quinoa, and arugula. I was going to add a like shredded cabbage mix, but I feel like it smelled a little weird. I bought it. I honestly don't remember when I bought it, probably like two weeks ago. And I never used it, so... Yeah, I don't know. We skipped that, but I'm gonna add the dressing. Then just mix all of this together. Okay, salad's done. Cut up some limes. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of fresh lime on top, but the salmon is done. I wanna show you guys how it came out because it looks perfect. Like it literally, the air fryer cooks the salmon so perfectly. Guys, this literally is so good. <laughs> I just took a bite. Like, you need to make this. Sweet green. Could never. This is so good. 
Salmon came out perfect. I saved half of it, and I'm gonna have it for lunch tomorrow. Put some greens together. Had a bunch of quinoa left over. I'm gonna cut up some tomatoes. It's like a perfect recipe where you don't have to cook the next day, which I always love. It's like already done for me. <laughs> so tired I just cleaned the whole entire apartment as you guys saw I get so many questions about how I clean and what I do um, and basically I just vacuum the floors and I will use like a Swiffer mop type thing to clean them and I clean the counters with this stuff right here it's literally the best this is what I use. It's the Method Surface Cleaner. And it's the ginger one. So, this is the cleaner that I use. I literally just spray it all over the counters and then just wipe with a paper towel. And whenever I'm cleaning the surfaces, I always make sure to take everything off so I can clean the whole thing, then put everything back on. So, that is what we did. And Milo was just chilling, chewing his bone. I cleaned my sheets. It's clean sheet night tonight. I'm so excited. He's getting a haircut, literally. In two days, I can't wait because I feel like his hair is so long. It's like getting it in, in his eyes. But I'm going to make some tea because I think I'm going to take a bath tonight. Welcome back to another vlog. I just got my nails done. I'll show you guys in a sec. But I hope that you enjoyed my little montage morning. I was kind of in a rush when I got up this morning. So I wanted to be able to like fit everything in. Um, and I also wanted to vlog today. So I just thought I would start it off that way. Plus I feel like everything I showed, you guys already know. Because I show it all the time. It's like my morning routine. But... Yeah, I just got my nails done. This is what I got. <laughs> I don't know what the color is called. It's just one of the gel colors from Mini Lux. Um, oh, I forget what it's called. I think it's B20 or something, B020. But usually they have like actual names, but this one was B something too. I don't know. So anyway, this is what I got, just light pink with i got like the extensions i wanted something neutral because i 
have like a lot that I'm doing these next few weeks and I just like don't know I feel like it just goes with everything I was gonna do like a fun color tip but then I was like I feel like I get so sick of things especially my nails I get so sick of them when they're like crazy and like wild colors I feel like just going neutral is always safest for me so that's what I did also I thought that the light pink was super cute because I'm going to Jess's baby shower next week so I got like little light pink but yeah um that's what's up I just love having long nails like I feel like I can put my rings back on finally <laughs> we'll do a little up close action so y'all can see just got home I'm gonna make well I'm making a little something to eat I'm toasting an English muffin right now, which is actually done. <laughs> it looks so toasty. I toast mine twice. I like to get them like extra crispy. And I'm gonna add some of this raw almond butter and some cut up banana. This has been like one of my favorite things to eat lately. If you really want to, when you make this, you can also add a little drizzle of honey, which makes it really delicious. I literally almost put, I, <laughs> I wasn't looking, I literally almost put chili powder on top of my English muffin. I'm trying to do cinnamon. Guys, comment down below. I've a few times, this has actually happened to me a few times, where I've tried to put cinnamon on stuff and I accidentally put cumin. And it's like the worst thing ever. <laughs> hey y'all. Hi. We're at the Celtics game right now. I want to show you guys my outfit, but I'm going to have to wait till after. Um, but. Yeah, boy. Dad. <laughs> yeah, where's True's dad at? I forgot that he was on the Celtics. Oh, I think he's right there. On the, on the Wait, I'm gonna zoom in. I think he's on the side. Like, the side. Because you know my blind ass can't see that far. <laughs> right, I think he's right there. Oh my god! Ayo! <laughs> This camera's good, Emma. Yeah. Wait, like this is really good. It's like we're courtside. Oh. 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 Literally earlier when Emma got her nails done. That's what she got. Wait, let me see close up. Those look so good. Oh, like now I wish I got that. See, I liked these three colors. I sent them to you. Yeah. Yellow, green, and orange. And the purple looks good in the white. Like those are subtle, you know? It's like a color, but it's subtle. And I like the way that your nail looks right here. Now I'm regretting. Okay. At least I have all spring. Guys, I think I'm onto something. <laughs> I just made a matcha and obviously made a matcha, but I put cinnamon in the almond milk, like poured a ton of cinnamon, and then I used my little electric handheld frother and I frothed it together and then I added the matcha. So I feel like I'm onto something right now, but I'm gonna try it. <laughs> yeah, it's so good. 
I highly recommend. <laughs> you guys need to try this. I feel like it makes such a big difference. Instead of just putting cinnamon on top, it's like all mixed in there. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. <laughs> Greetings over for dinner. Look who got a haircut. I didn't show Milo's haircut yesterday. <gasps> but don't He's so boy. handsome. He doesn't look like a mop anymore. So we're making dinner tonight. I... We are having celery. <laughs> we're gonna make some eggplant parm. So I'll show you guys as we go, but I'm gonna start the dessert for this Wednesday night dinner. We have the Simple Mills almond flour baking mix. We're gonna make the chocolate cupcakes. And we also got this to go with it. Just waiting for these to cool, and we can start. And for Grandpa to finish <laughs> writing these damn Wait, I'm gonna try something. <laughs> they look good though. Boing, 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 yo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, because I put them all in there. Okay. Already? Yeah. Oh, Maggie, like, they're just gone. What do you mean? Like, <laughs> like they're just like, like, they probably melted a long time ago. <laughs> Wait. That's what, what about? We oh my god, well, that's what we wanted. What about cookies though? Why does that's it? That's probably why it was fudgy. Oh my god, that's. <laughs> you normally like. Oh my like, god. Put, the, put it in when it's like warm, you know? Wait, you know what I realized? I was taking the toothpick and I was like yeah. sticking it and it I was like, great in. It's fudgy. And I was like, they're not cooked yet, but it was literally probably the chocolate chips. Yeah, take them out to cool. Oh my god, let's get a cooling rack. Yeah, these things are fine. There's no Wednesday night dinner. Okay guys, we're done. Vegan eggplant, parm, little salad, and some bonza pasta.